hey, this is Dave with OC Astronomy. And there was one thing um, that I did not do when I changed my RA worm block for my Paramount My T. Um, and I have had trouble the last couple of days and then I figured it out. Uh, the motor has an index to it that tells it where it's at as it goes around. And if you swap out one RA motor for another RA motor, um, that changes. And so the index, uh, the exact index changes. So the problem that I was having was um, if you tell it to slew as it would get close to the meridian but not not where it should be going in any not in any dangerous way but even as it got close to it it was telling me that the mount could not go there because of the slew limits and so um, it wouldn't it wouldn't even find like I was trying to get to Jupiter last night and it wouldn't even go to Jupiter because it said it was in a dangerous location for the mount and it was not the slew limits and so um, that's obviously not right from how it was last night so uh, what I need to do is that said that there is a, a sticker on the inside of the of the motor uh, uh, underneath the housing that should tell me the uh, offset and then also in uh, BISC TCS there's a way to check the offset so I'm gonna check and see what it says it is and then I'm gonna check and see what it actually is and if they're different then I'll have to edit the entry on the Sky X and then I'll be able to tell uh, where the uh, tell the RA motor where it's really is and then hopefully it'll let me slew where I need to go so let's have a look all right so I've connected to my mount and I've told it to go to home position and it finds home position okay you can tell it's uh, it's moving to where it needs to go there's home now if I tell it let's see if I tell it to go to uh, there's my slew limits that are marked pretty clearly um, if I just tell it to go to Regulus right now, um, let's see, it should tell me an error. If I tell it to slew to this and say OK, oh, of course, now it's not going to, it's going to go ahead and do that. <laughs> Never happens when you're, uh, when you tell it to, right? We'll try one more star in that area and see if it tells me if it's at slew limits or not. I'll try something a little bit closer to the meridian. Well, it is working. So we'll let it get to there, and then we'll let it center. Okay, so there, I just told it to slew from uh, from this star Regulus over to here and you can tell by the purple and red where my mount limits are um, and it says this is not possible because the target is beyond the slew limit well it's not even into the slew limit and the reason why I, is because I believe the motor index is off so the first thing I'm going to do is go to TCS the, the, the um, telescope uh, control system and I think if I bring this up, I can have it go to um, motor parameters and index angle. Let's see what. So if I go to index angle, it says 212 for the RA and uh, 3800 for the declination. So this is where it thinks uh, the motor index is. Um, and then you can edit that um, you can also have it measure it but before I go through the trouble to measure it I'm gonna take off the housing um, and see if it's listed on the motor block I'm gonna check that out first all right we'll give that a try and then we'll come back here and, and see what we got okay so I took the motor housing off and um, I looked for a sticker that might have the info on it there is a sticker here, but it doesn't give me an RX uh, or an RA index number. And I looked all around the housing uh, and it doesn't. I don't want to take off this worm block since it's already on there and it's working good. Um, I would rather not. So what I'm going to have it do instead is measure the, um, the index point. 
Um, so I'm going to put the cover back on and then I'm just going to have it try to measure it and uh, tell me what it reports back. Okay, so in the Sky, uh, the TCS, um, there is something under utilities and set motor index angle. And so um, what it says to do is to reboot it, then measure the index, um, and then uh, you can save it to, uh, to that. So first I'm going to get what it says. That should tell me just what it, what it is now. All right, so there you have 212 and 3859. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the scope in balance mode um, so that there's no drag on the motor. And then I'm going to uh, reboot it for indexing. Um, I'll do that. And uh, that'll take a, just a minute to do. It's going to, uh, to reboot. All right, and then I'm going to measure the RA index. Make sure it's in the balance uh, position and then it has been restarted. And do it now, yes. All right, so it's going to do its thing. Okay, so there, the motor index angle is 182 is what it measured. All right, so um, that is that is a little bit off from what it was before, 212 or whatever it was. And then I'm gonna save that to BIS TCS. Okay, so I disconnected and rebooted and rehomed it and it found home. Uh, and now I'm gonna get from the board where it thinks uh, the motor indexes are. And now it knows that the index is 182. Um, so that's that's really good. I'm going to close this. Uh, now I'm going to send it back to this star that I had trouble slewing to. And it should slew there. Let's go uh, slew. Yes. And there it goes. So it's going to... Huh. Funnily enough, now it's going to go from this side. And it's going to tell me it's okay because the slew limit is set to allow it to uh, go this much past the meridian and so it's going to have no trouble slewing there. Very interesting. Alright, so um, if you do ever have to replace your worm block um, or any of your uh, motors on the MyT, then you need to do this and make sure that the control system, the BIS TCS, is updated with the current index positions. Um, and before you install it, you might want to see if there's a sticker or something that has that index on there. If not, then you have to put it into balance mode and let it, let it scroll through and let it try to find its index. Uh, and then you need to store that uh, to the circuit board so that it'll have it there on the right index. All right. Uh, so awesome. It lets me slew to where I need to go to now. And uh, that's all I have. Clear skies, everybody.